Uh, King Brandon. Oh. Oh, and it looks as though the king is dead. Died from severe stress. And his son Brandon becomes the new king of the north. Medium realm authority. We'll approve. We want him to like us. He really does not like me at all. I need to educate our last son then. Uh, I'm going to go for Gendel. I'd like to make him at least a good fighter. I want him to at least get that skilled fighter. So Gendel might be able to do it. But yeah. A lot of things going on in Dorne at the moment. All hail is grace. Brand of the house Stark. King in the north. King of winter and the first men. Lord of winter and protector of the realm. The king in the north. There we go. So we now have a king in the new king in the north. So that could have some interesting developments. Maybe some of the factions would change. No. No, it looks like everyone's still loyal to the Starks. I mean, he is quite a good ruler. I'll have to wait and see how he does. I need a new priest. I guess Myrtle is probably the best choice. There we go. Better than nothing, I guess. Mandalese, how are you doing? Still no boy. They still haven't given away the neck yet, it looks like. The neck is still just underneath the king. Flints, how are you doing? We've had two daughters so far. Not so good. Homewards. Now, he actually finally had a son. So maybe we could marry the first daughter. Two years old. God, that's way too young. And we finally had a daughter, people. Lesa. Lieta? Lisa. I'm going to say. Lisa. I'm going to say Lisa. Lisa Stain. The Y is normally pronounced like an I, so. Lesser? I would guess Rhaenys Targaryen just died, was murdered on the orders of Englantine. Oh, the concubine of Aegon. But she's at the moment in. Oh, so he imprisoned her after. Wow, so Aegon. Jesus, his own concubine was obviously uh, jealous of her being his favourite. So she killed him. Uh, killed her. And now Aegon had to. Throw her in jail. He's now left just infirm. Damn. Verlaine. And he just... Oh my god. He betro <laughs> He's betrothed himself to his own daughter. Oh my god. That is disgusting. I mean, Verlaine doesn't have much options, really. There's not really any... <laughs> there's not really any other Targaryens left. A daughter was born to Howl and Stayed. And Pala the Unfaithful. Are you bloody kidding me? What a bloody name to have. Holly Snow. She had that with Oof. Oof, you, you... Are you kidding me, Oof? You just had a bastard. You, you slept with your brother's wife. Are you kidding me, Oof? God damn you. We need to get you bloody married. <laughs> we need to get him married off someone. Because otherwise he's going to have it with everyone. Jesus. I can't believe it. Okay, the Glovers. Nope, still just daughters. What about the king? What about this daughter? This huge daughter. That could be a nice one. No, god damn it. I'm starting to think Myrtle might fancy me. Deceitful, temperate, kind, charitable, proud. Well, there's nothing saying I wouldn't. Um, and there's nothing saying I would, but we have deceitful, so I might be more inclined to kind of go against my wife's back. Even though I'm kind, I want to share the love. Let's make a move then. I think he'll be that kind of guy gone. We went to a chamber and give her a good tumble. Excellent. It's always good to have a good tumble. The fever's broken, perhaps only temporarily, but I can still see the shadowy figures lurking in the corners. I've gained the lunatic trait. Oh my god. Gorn is now a lunatic. See, I do feel that that happens more often than it should. I do really feel like that. It does feel like that pops up a lot more than it should be. My maester. Okay, just go back then. Okay, I don't know why the maester got kicked off. As you arrive at court, you see Hagon fix you with a steady gaze. At first you think nothing of it, but you soon hear the talk of the court. Everyone knows that Myrtle is pregnant, and worse, everyone knows that you're the father, that treacherous whore. I suppose she had no choice. Well, I, I am kind, kind and charitable, yeah, I suppose she had no choice. I'm a lunatic, but still. And an adulterer, apparently. Of course. <laughs> we know that. We know I'm an adulterer. No, no marriage, that's going to help. My wife doesn't seem very content at the moment. She wants more clothes and better shoes. Well, I'm charitable, yeah. 
My dear, I can't refuse you anything. I'm charitable. I'm going to give her the stuff she wants. I'm sorry. <laughs> so I've got a lover who's now pregnant, but I'm also giving in to my wife and buying her stuff. Jesus. Come on, Gorn. Get your act together. His three daughters. Ooh. I wish you'd accept matrilineal. No, yeah. Uh, winter's coming to an end. No, I do not need help with my titles. Um, Osric of Carhold has died comatose in bed. That's still nowhere near to going back up to its top. We've still got a long way to go. Go into hiding. Does that mean someone's trying to kill me? Depose the king. Yeah, we know someone's trying to kill me. Lady Kyra of Shadowmoor. Why would she be trying to kill me? The Nor Oh, the Nori's wife. She does not like me at all, I guess, because I'm married to her daughter. Yeah. God damn, they look a little similar. God damn it. <laughs> but she's trying to kill me. That's not good. Oh, this Lady Flint. She inherited this land. They have a three-year-old daughter. Let's do it. Yeah, go on. Let's marry it to Oof. Oof, you're going to marry a Flint. Maybe we'll try and kill her other sons. We're going to wait until she gets married. Yeah, I've got to wait until they actually get married. I think, okay, let's actually go look for this land then. Let's go take this, I think. He has 900 men. We should be able to take that on. If one of my allies comes, we should be fine. Howland or Vale. I can't do it for Oof. Yeah, Oof has a weak claim. Weak claim. Why can't I do it for the other one? They all have it. Huh. That's weird. Is it because he's my heir? I guess I can't give it to him. I guess I could give it to one of my other sons. Um, you know, Howland would be a good choice. Married to a cast stack. That gives him a good alliance to protect himself, I guess. And he's still betrothed. Yes, the cast stack one could be good because then the cast stacks could protect him. Except now we have no alliance with the cast stacks because he died. Yeah, god damn it. Okay, so the cast stacks cannot protect him. Okay, we might need to wait for the Dustin one then to go. Then we could marry to the Dustin. He finally had a son, apparently. Oh, yeah, that was his wife. That was my son. And he's got quick. <laughs> um, acknowledge him as mine. I'm deceitful, temperate, kind, prat. Would I legitimize him? Huh. I think maybe I might be inclined to legitimize I'm a proud man, and he's quite a good kid. He's got quick. Temperate, kind, charitable. Yeah, let's acknowledge him as mine. We'll see later. Maybe we will. Uh, Howlin Snow. Harlan Snow. Um, Timion the Rock has declared Western of War for Lord Gerard's claim on Harpshire. Okay, so the two boy kings of the Rock and the Gardeners have declared war on one another. That can only end in tears before bedtime, I think. Okay, yeah, all this looks kind of the same as before down here. Oh, St when did she disappear? Okay, the queen gave up her position to let her son rule. 21 years old. My wife is pregnant. See, I've done quite a good job so far getting pregnancies and stuff. Okay, did they win then? And so they took Bramsfort. Okay, so they got Bramsfort then to become his vassal. Okay, riding through the country together with my escort, I come upon a lonely inn. It is empty aside from a nervous-looking innkeeper who nonetheless promises food and wine at a very reasonable price. My party and I sit down at the table. Okay, this is bad. Did Lady Kira just get me? Innkeeper, bring us the best you have to offer. Soon after the innkeeper disappears into the kitchen, we notice a foul odour emanating from somewhere below the floorboards. One of my escort pulls open a loose floorboard to reveal a massive manure pit. Before we can react further to this bizarre find, the floor explodes beneath my feet. Kaboom. I knew it. I knew they were going to kill me. God damn it. And we became Oof of Skagos. So there we go. <laughs> We've gone through two stains in very quick succession. So we're now Oof. Um, that is not how I wanted things to go down at all. But we know probably it was the Nore's. The Nore's wife. That bitch. We'll get her back one day. But yeah, let's have a look at who we are now then. Oof. Our father will get them back. But we're ambitious, man. We're shy. We're just. We're brave. And we're cynical. And we're a poor fighter. It's so only four dual skill. Hmm. 
I'm not sure what type of man he would be. I guess maybe a hunter or an intriguer. I guess our, our father died of intrigue. Huh. Maybe hunting? Yeah, let's go for hunting. I'm kind of brave. I'm just, though, and ambitious and cynical. I think the just would stop me from being intrigue for his thing, maybe. Let's go for hunting, then. My grandfather was a hunter, after all. I remember those days. Okay, let's go for that, then, for him. He's kind of more that type, I think, for now. It could change in the future. We can still attack Arundel. Um, not for myself, though, apparently. I think we might have to do that, then. Do we have any allies, then? We only have that... Oh, we have no allies now. My new heir is Howland... Stain. God damn, I can't believe that happened to us. Can't believe it. Off to go through my titles? No. Okay, let's have a quick we'll just rebuilding our men as well. My vassal was liking us. Ah. That is so that's actually really annoying. That's kind of messed everything up for us at the moment. Okay, we'll have to wait until we have that marriage to the Flint girl. God damn, it's gonna be so far away. I might have to break the betrothal and marry someone else. That might be the best thing to do. Let's go for our council then. With a new, you know, if a new ruler comes, possibly a new council. Always a good time to check. Treasurer, nope. Hagon, nope. Okay, all looks good then. Do we have any friends or rivals? We have a couple of rivals. Aurel, he's now gone to the wall though, so that's fine. And we have Rickon Crowl. Okay, that's not good because he'll become the Lord of Deep Down. <laughs> <laughs> and he's going to be my rival. Jesus Christ. Okay, close the teeth. Eight gold. Well, that's nice to see. God damn. That has not gone well for us. We had a really good beginning as well. And now it's just been kind of mishaps. Investigate Howland's legitimacy. God damn. People, stop it. Stop this now. Yeah, with the men I have now, this is not good. Yeah, we don't have any allies. Travelers bring rumors of fire and blood. They say that the dragons have once more, and that Balm and Baratheon now rides Lenga into battle. Balm and Baratheon. That kind of makes sense. You know, the son of Ori's Baratheon, the only son, being able to ride a dragon kind of makes sense. Just like his father, a great warrior. And he's now riding Lengard. Lengar, sorry. He's a lunatic dragon. Uh, a son to an unknown dragon. Okay. So there's two dragon riders. His daughter obviously has her own dragon. She is now betrothed not to her father, but now to a Valerian, which is kind of nice to see. <laughs> not actually Aegon, but it's actually a matrilineal one as well, so that's good to see as well. A new Lord Commander on the wall. We can have a quick look to see who became the new Lord Commander. Your young uncle has approached me with a request. He desires to travel to foreign lands, where he says he will stay for a number of months. This tour will perhaps make him a better man. Um, I'll give you the coin. Good luck. Yes. I think we'll be nice about this. Congratulations, Arsa Sten. You're my uncle, after all. You just want to go have... You just go on your adventures, don't you? Don't you? God damn. People don't know who you are. Lose 50 gold. Ooh. Ooh, I'd like to do it, though. He's on a quest overseas. Go have fun, Arsen. Go find what you can. Explore. See the world. Now, who is it? Lord Commander Harmon of the Shadow. So it's an Ulla. Okay, an Oak Carl looks like he's next in line. Uh, my father had a son, Soren Stain. Okay, lots of brothers there. Now, the Shadow Tower is controlled by a Bulwer still. I think it's the same guy as before. And we have Lyman Viperin, a Riverman controlling the East Watch by the Sea. Okay. What's this? Please don't be trying to kill me. We've had enough people to kill our family members. But yeah. Today my brother asked me for a thief of his own to govern. You know what? I probably should give someone Driftmark. I should only be controlling one place. Yeah. Okay, Veilnstein. You can have... You know, you're a brave man. You're a good man. You're going to marry the Dustin girl. Okay, very well. So we've given him Driftmark for Veon. There we go. So that puts us back to our normal domain size. So that's kind of good. Um, yeah, it's put down our men a bit, but hopefully that will go back up. So we've kind of now got an actual structure here now. A stain controls Driftwood Hall, as it should be. A stain should control that. The crowns control deep down, and we have King's House as our capital. So that's, that's pretty, it's looking good there, it's just we haven't been able to expand at all. Just because we're going to have to wait for all these claims to go through with our children. 
have people die and whatnot. But yes, a daughter was born to Howland Stain. Okay, Dire Stain. They've had a, they've had a daughter. The first daughter, technically, yeah, because the other one was a bastard. With me. Yes, it was with me, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, oof, you sneaky devil. Well, you'll be married soon. You can have your own kids. You don't have to worry about other people's wives. This is the teeth. We get seven gold. Perfect. Okay. Now, I kind of want to look for my own wife. Like a different one. Another teeth? God damn. He's doing a good job. He's doing a good job. But I wouldn't mind collecting another wife. Okay, the rock and the uh, the reach are fighting still. You still have the neck, yeah? Oh, wow. Brandon's already 52. He's already gotten pretty old. Look at that. 52 years old. And his son is not as good. He's a craven and stuff. He was a skilled fighter, but look at the stats. And he, all his children are dead. Married to a Mandalay, though. And it would be this one. Now, I would love to marry that, that mirror. No, yeah. Betrothal can go ahead. Yep. Okay, fine. Marry the Tollet girl. That's fine. Okay, there we go. Perfect. So we've now got another marriage done. Still, still lots of other sons and stuff. Um, yeah, this one's this one needs to get married. Arson. What? Arson. Arson's dead. No. What happened to my uncle? We sent him on a trip. And he died of illness abroad. Oh no. The 27th of May. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Arson. So only have two brothers left. Gavin. <laughs> and one is on the wall, apparently. Jesus. He has no position at all. Okay, so then the son's here. Okay, Ethan didn't turn out. He didn't actually get skilled fighter, sadly, either. Jesus. Okay. But still lots of potentials there. Only one bloody daughter of all of those. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Now the trident just got this. The bywater. That's an interesting one for them. That's given a nice extra piece of land from the Stormlands. I can't imagine the Stormlands are happy about that. He's married to a swan. I don't mean he's, actually, he's married to a person of the family swan. Not actually married to a, 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 a bird. That that would be uh, that'd be ridiculous. That'd be crazy. That'd be stupid. Don't be ridiculous. God damn. Let's have a look at East then before we finish off this session of recording. Um, Everything looks kind of normal. The Brindermen still control this land. Your love has sent you a gift. It is a small puppy. Okay, I think I'll take this. Yeah, I'm a shy man. Maybe this will help us. Here we go. Faithful hunter, tricky other. I think we'd probably go for faithful. I think our guy would like a faithful dog. Yeah. A dog we can rely upon. Now, everything else in the east kind of looks normal. Hazdan is still there. Okay. Quarth is still there. Yai Tai. Did that guy take it over? Peasant Revolt. Boo! No, it looks like Boo still controls it. The gods of Yai Tai. Yeah, it looks like he won. Great Father Haikun the Infirm. Slave raid on Bayashabad. Interesting. So it looks like he defeated the uh, the other guy, or he died. Magister Trago accepted his offer. Oh, it looks as though Pentos took Dragonstone. Interesting. Okay, that's a good place, I think, to end this session. So I'm going to think I'm going to end it here. Um, so things got a bit interesting. Things did not go so well for us in this recording session. Did not go as we planned at all. And yes, Pentos has taken Dragonstone. So he's now taken uh, Claw Isle. Now the Ironborn have taken off all of this, basically. So he's left with just Claw Isle and Driftmark. That is a shame. Things are not going well for the Targaryens at all. And his daughter... What the... Where's your daughter? Oh my god, it looks as though she was found out to be a bastard, apparently. Or at least someone made him think she was a bastard. So now... She has a dragon, but she's a bastard. 26, Marshall. Look at that. Jesus. Apparently, she's a bit of a lunatic. She's definitely... A, I don't know. To me, she seems like his his daughter. But that means Ori's will inherit. The Baratheons will take over. 
that's an interesting development. But yeah, so things haven't gone to plan as we wanted so far. We will attack Arundel at some point, like I've said before, but there's no point in just jumping in because we have, we have the claims for a long time. So we, we don't really have to jump in just yet. We need to make sure we're ready. But yeah, we've kind of... Yeah, we've got the Dustins now. Yeah. But things definitely did not go as we planned, and the North is still extremely stable. The Starks are keeping it extremely stable. We're not getting any chaos at the moment, which is a shame, but we have Skagos. We're keeping Skagos. We seem to have secured the loyalty of our men. We just need to wait for King's House to kind of grow a bit, kind of get its men back, as it seems. But yeah, I hope you join us next time, where we'll continue our story as the Stains. And I've been NG Paradox. Good night.